gonna do today? We're gonna learn uh -huh. and play okay. Sing a song and pray That's right. God really loves us God really, really cares About you, me, our families That's right God's always right to California. I'm going to California to visit my family. So am I. Yes. Wait, what if your family that you're visiting is the same family that I'm visiting? What if your family is my family? I doubt that, Callie, but it would be cool. I kind of think of you as family. The same for you. My mom and dad said that Stacy and I could sit together on the plane and look out the window together. It's such a beautiful day to be flying. Callie, what is your favorite thing to look at out the window of an airplane? I think I like to look at the clouds. Look, that one looks like a rabbit. Yeah, and that one looks like a turtle with a necklace on. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Hmm, I wonder if we keep looking at the clouds, what big, amazing things we might see. You want to look with us? Let's wander together. That was fun! What did you see? Callie, you know what's my favorite thing to look at out of a plane window? Ooh, what? It's the mountains. Look, there they are. When I look at the mountains out of the window, I like to picture myself on top of the mountains waving back at me. Hello! Oh, yeah! Hey, look, it's me and you on top of those mountains waving back. Hi! All this looking at big clouds and big mountains makes me think about just how big God is. God made all of this? Whoa, so the clouds and the mountains are big, but God's even bigger? Yep. Wowzers, I need to wonder about that for a while. Let's check out our Bible story for today. Today's Bible story comes from Job chapter 38. After Job lost his family, his health, and everything he owned, he still didn't do or say anything against God. Job thought about the days where things were good, like when he spent time with his children. He missed those days. Even though Job trusted God, Job had many questions. His friends tried to tell him that Job must have done something wrong. They thought God was punishing Job for something, but Job knew he didn't do anything wrong. Still, he didn't have any answers. So Job asked his questions to God. Job wanted to know why God was letting this happen to him. After a while, out of a storm, God finally answered Job, but it wasn't in the way Job expected. God had some questions for Job too. God asked Job questions like, where were you when I created the whole world? And do you tell lightning bolts where to go? And do you provide food for lions and ravens? Job couldn't answer these questions. That's because God didn't ask these questions for Job to really answer. God was helping Job remember how big God is. God was the one who created the whole world. God was the one who tells lightning bolts where to go. God provides food for lions and ravens. God was bigger than Job knew. Job was a tiny part of the whole universe God made. God wanted Job to trust God when Job couldn't understand what was going on. Things can get hard for us too, and you may feel it's unfair. Even when we don't understand why we're going through something, God is still in control. God is bigger than we could ever understand. Flying in this plane makes me think about the wild trip Job went on. What do you mean? Job didn't travel anywhere. No, he didn't. But sometimes when we go through something big or scary, it can feel like we went on a long journey. What do you mean? Job had to go through a lot. He lost everything. His family, his stuff, he even got sick. His friends didn't help him feel better. All of this probably made Job feel like he was traveling all by himself on a very tough journey. I think I understand. My dad's mom died when I was really, really little. I don't remember her. And when my dad talks about that, he always says he went through a lot, like a journey or a trip, but he didn't go anywhere. Yeah, that's it. And I'm so sorry that happened. Thanks. I feel really sad for my dad when he talks about it. 
My dad also talks about being thankful to God when he went through that. Why would he be thankful to God while he was going through something hard? It can be confusing, but you see, God is with us when we go through these hard journeys. God is with us all along the way. Those hard things, like your dad losing his mom, can feel as big as the mountains or as big as the clouds, but we can be thankful. God is bigger than we could ever understand. Stacy, I'm so glad we saw each other on this plane ride to California. It was so fun to fly with you, Callie. And it was fun to fly with all of you, too. The next time you're going through something really hard, look at the clouds and remember that God is bigger. God is bigger than we could ever understand. Thanks for learning and growing with us. Peace out. <laughs>